Trouble and Crisis kind of describes what my life was like for the better part of 19 years. I experienced, you know, not wanting to be Native anymore. You know, not wanting to be in your own skin. I got into, like, drugs and drinking, and that's when I went downhill, I guess. Why would I want to voluntarily say I'm Indian when I hear how they talk about Indians? Last year, a group of filmmakers, artists, and healthcare professionals came together for a common purpose, to make a film. I've always wanted to send a message, you know, because I was like considered a lost cause by the people in my reserve. Well, I've never done any acting before. She's like, well, have you ever done, what have you done performing-wise? I'm like, well, I was a cheerleader. We wanted to do something to help lower the suicide rates being experienced by First Nations youth. People relate to it. And I hope that it saved at least a life out there, you know. I could really relate to my character because it was the very same experience. I started to realize that the real stories were the lives of Brent, Brittany, Candace, and Kristen. It's hard for me to say that I attempted suicide because I know that I didn't want to die. I'm going to make sure my kids don't ever go through what I went through. You know, they tried to do something to us, but look, we're still here. We can survive. You know, when you're like aware of stuff, like you have to do something with it. Some people write things or, I don't know, I make art. 